Hello and welcome to South Key Eye Specialist Centre. Uh, let me introduce myself. My name is uh, Dr. Yip. So my experience in this refractive field has been since 2004, at which time it was uh, very much different, right? We were doing a lot of uh, LASIK, Epilasic, LASIK. These are all different methods in refractive surgery where the surgery is performed onto the cornea of the eye. Okay, uh, there are pros and cons in having these surgeries on the cornea, but uh, the one which I dislike the most is that uh, it's not reversible, you know. It's relatively safe, but if something happens, uh, it's, 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 it's difficult to tackle these, these, these cases. All these complications on the cornea uh, has made me a bit wary and uh, we are offering different options to the patient right now. We're talking about a group of people where they are young, okay, they are active, but they do not like to wear glasses. So the margin for error is very small here. What they want is they just want a quick, safe, easy surgery, which they can be happy with for the rest of their life. In comes fake kick lenses. It's basically the same method of surgery where we insert a lens, if you can imagine, a contact lens. The, of course, the design and the material is different. A lens inserted inside the eyes. Effectively, what this does is you do not need to wear glasses. You do not need to put in contact lens. We do not need to do that anymore. It's, it's very simple nowadays, right? Uh, and and uh, the safety issue has uh, improved tremendously. Okay, so the lenses that we're talking about has evolved tremendously, right? We used to start with uh, uh, animal-based material, the sizing, various issues. But as in all things, it evolves, right? Uh, in the current situation, we have lenses that are non-origin based, no prior procedure to the surgery. It takes you five minutes it's just like inserting a contact lens into your eyes. Instead, we'll insert the lens into your eyes, not onto the eyes, into the eyes. You come out of the surgery, you're fine. Currently, one of my favorite lens uh, and the one that I use quite often is the Icryl lens from Biotech. Uh, why? I, 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 the, the best thing about it is the ease of use. Right? Because most... Uh, Eye surgeons we have done many cataract surgeries and this is it's just like inserting another lens into the eye but into a, a different compartment okay this lens is also not uh, animal based okay and uh, we get a good bulk and the sizing is is easy to 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 calculate right it's, 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 it's a beautiful lens anybody who's interested in refractive surgery uh, my advice is to seek an uh, experienced uh, refractive surgeon. Sit down and have a chat. Sit down and have a chat. There's many things that, that the, the surgeon, the person, would need to do for you before embarking on any advice. He will need to measure your cornea thickness. He will need to measure your anterior chamber depth. He will need to measure your axial length your white to white, the size of your eyes, whether you're, you are predisposed to uh, uh, certain diseases like inflammation, whether you have pre-existing condition, you may already have things like glaucoma or some macular degeneration, degeneration which you uh, do not know of. All this will be done uh, during your visit to the, your uh, ophthalmologist. Okay? So I hope you have uh, learned or you have gathered some information uh, about the current state of uh, refractive uh, surgeries. Uh, like I mentioned, is uh, this is this is a happy surgery. It's something that uh, people want, and if they want to embark on it, you need to have proper advice. Okay, um, the safety issue is uh, is quite good. It's effectively very very safe surgeries. The complications are very minimal. We do expect the patient to be happy every time. Okay?